Hey everybody, it's been quite some time since I last did a video, especially my culture shock series, which kind of seemed to just bloop, died. And so I wanted to revive it by making another video about something that I thought was of interest. Okay, so when I before I even left to China, I have a Japanese grandmother who spent a lot of time in Taiwan. And so when I was getting ready to go to China in September, um, she actually gave me two rolls of toilet paper to bring with me. And now most of you are probably wondering, why would she give you toilet paper? Like she insisted. I was like, no, I don't need it. Like I'll just leave it. My luggage is too heavy. But no, she was like, take it. Put this in your bag, you'll need it. And I thought, okay, this is a little crazy, but whatever. And so when I arrived to China, the first night that I was there, okay, my apartment did not have any toilet paper, so thank you, Grandma. But not only that, um, having toilet paper is super common, and people carry it around everywhere. Why? Because they have something called squat toilets. Squatters. I don't, I actually don't even know what they're called. But I'm pretty sure most of you guys who are in China are very familiar with these toilets. And they smell like, you know, bathrooms. They're not exactly the best facilities in the world. And something that you have to bring, especially if you're a female and you're going into the bathroom, are these little bad boys. Toilet paper. Okay, so it's just like a tiny little packet. You open it up and bam, there are tissues. But let me tell you, that was a little bit overwhelming for me. Actually, it wasn't that overwhelming. It was like, okay, that makes sense. And quite frankly, I do prefer the squatting toilets because you don't have to actually put your bum down on the seat, you know? But it does explain why a lot of times after I leave the bathroom, you know, there's some people that will leave a lot of uh, remains on the toilet seat. I know who you guys are. Or I know where you're from, actually, is the better way to put it. Okay, well... I know a lot of people probably talk about being completely shocked with the toilets, but I was actually surprised that I had to purchase tissues to carry around with me everywhere in China because it's inevitable. You will not find a bathroom unless it's, it caters to foreigners or it's in a fancy like American or foreign friendly hotel, you will not find toilet paper. Okay, so if you guys ever go to China or Taiwan, I'm not too sure about the rest of Asia, make sure to bring with you toilet paper. <laughs> or you don't have to bring it, but make sure to carry it on you. All right, well, that's my video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Um, please subscribe, like, comment this video. Did you ever think that this was the case? 